stubby and they've already been partially chewed up, you're going to be able to convert them to glucose in your blood way faster than if your digestive system has to attack it a thousand different ways to get to the same food. So that brush of sugar comes faster with the simpler, less complex carbs. So there, there's that point right there. You, it's kind of a separate issue. Instead of just looking at it as simple versus complex, how processed is it? It could still be a complex carbohydrate, but if it's uh, like in white bread, Wonder Bread, <laughs> has, it has starch molecules in it, right? These are long branch molecules. So technically speaking, that would be a complex carb, but nutritionally, I don't think most people would associate that word with it compared to a whole grain nut bread or something like that. So the health benefits of them are different. And generally, the less processed and the more complex it is, the better. Okay, let's turn our attention to the storage polysaccharides. This is, these are uh, compounds like starch that store energy, and let's not forget they also store building blocks. It's not just for the caloric content that we use, and we can use some of the glucose molecules to convert to other things. Like if you're doing cell division, you're going to need ribose, you might convert some of the glucose to ribose to make the DNA. So it stores both energy and building. 